everyone, welcome to my channel and welcome to another edition of Subscription Box Sunday. Today, I have seven different boxes to share with you guys, or is it seven? I don't remember which way it is. <laughs> So this week we have the Fruit for Thought box for September, the Better Beauty box for September, the Copper and Pine box for October, the Silver Swag box for October, the Entry MV Halloween box, and the Journal Junk box and Journal Junk Sack for October. If you're new to my channel, welcome or welcome back. My name is Katrina and I am a sub box lover. I love to share subscription boxes with all of you sub box lovers out there. So if you like subscription boxes, unboxing videos, things like that, on Sundays I unbox multiple at once so you can see them all in one video. And if you like these videos, make sure to give them a thumbs up and make sure that you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on a future upload. <music> I'm super happy that you're here today spending part of your Sunday with me because it's seven boxes. It'll probably be a little bit longer. So make sure that you grab a little drink, a little snack to get through this. Um, I think I got this um, cup. It says I need space in a previous journal junk box from maybe like last year this time. Um, and I'm drinking a Concord grape liquid IV today. So kind of want a snack, but maybe there'll be a snack in one of these boxes that I'll try. We'll see. Um, I think we're going to kick things off with the September boxes and then go into October. So up first, let's jump into the Fruit for Thought box for September. Now, if you're unfamiliar with the Fruit for Thought box, this is a monthly, what I would consider lifestyle subscription, where each month the products inside are themed based on a fruit or a food theme. I think this one might be like afternoon tea. And when I say lifestyle, you get food related products, gadgets, snacks, beauty, sometimes home decor, like all sorts of different products inside this box. This box is $41.99 a month. You get five to seven products inside. Now this box and all of the boxes in today's video were sent to me free for review. And for this box, I do have a 10% off coupon code down below in case you're interested in signing up. All right, when you open it up, that's what it looks like. It's kind of a bigger box than usual, so I'm curious to see what's inside. Okay, so the theme this month is afternoon tea, and the theme for October is carrot cake, yum. Now, if you want to see some of the, month, the themes for future months, I think they do put like three or four months out on their website if you're curious and seeing like what some of the other themes be, but I'm curious to see about the afternoon tea treats. So it says, for September, we've put together an afternoon tea to go, including lots of fruity treats. Just add tea, yum. We hope you enjoy one of our best-selling boxes yet. Okay, well, the very first thing that I'm pulling out is this here, which seems to be like one of those like soup reheatable thingies. Okay, let's see what it says here. So this is from French Bowl NYC. This is their Mandala Everything Mug, which is spill-proof and leak-proof. Used for all of your hot drinks, snacks, and meals. It has a vented lid that locks tight. It is dishwasher safe, but it does say hand wash recommended and is microwave safe. So I guess you can like make a tea in this, or you could also like do soup. Oh my gosh. It was like sealed, so I couldn't take it off and then it let all the air out. So that's really cool. It does like vacuum seal shut. So if you wanted to like take soup to lunch with you, you could, you know, have it all vacuum sealed in here. Now for a drink, you'd have to take the total lid off, but it does have like a steam vent. It has a little mandala there and I like that it has that. So you could use it as a mug, it is plastic. Um, and I probably will use this for soup because this is big for a mug but I think this would be great for like reheating soup at work or you know on the go for a little picnic, things like that. So very cool. Okay, we have some fun treats. So we got two, I think these are cookies from Molly B's Cookies. So um, we have a bee cordial, so it's maraschino cherries, semi-sweet chocolate and a delicious amaretto flavoring. And we have the tea, which is spill the Earl Grey lavender and white chocolate. Um, with a lemon glaze. Ooh, yummy. So two different flavored cookies here. And these look like they're thick, chunky cookies. It's hard to tell, but we get two different flavor of these cookies. Ooh, up next we have a little baking kit. I love these, or like just baking kits in general. So this is from Dr. Pete's. And um, this is their lemon blueberry scones baking mix. So you add one cup of cream and you cut it into triangles and bake on a baking sheet for 15 minutes and you've just made the perfect scones for your afternoon tea. Oh, I, I love doing like little baking kits. I like baking and I do bake from scratch, particularly in the fall, but I also like just having baking kits, which just is more fun and eat, not more fun, but sometimes it's a little bit easier 
So I'm really, really excited to make some scones or scones or however you want to say them. Then it also has these two little preserves to go with the scones. So we have, these are from Wilkins and Sons Limited. There's a raspberry preserve or a lemon curd that you can have with the scones that you make or obviously with anything. So two cute little jars. Then we have some cute little plates from Talking Tables. This is like a little Mad Hatter tea party theme. So it says time for tea and they have like a little scalloped edge. So a cute little plate, so it's a set of 12 that you can have your little tea treats on. Then from Lark Fine Foods, we have their pistachio cherry sable that features a traditional French shortbread which stars crunchy pistachios, dried tart cherries, and is rimmed with sparkling sugar. Ooh, oh, there are so many good snacks. This is definitely a snack food heavy box and I am here for that. Ooh, this looks good too and I really like the packaging. This is from Jocelyn Sweet Things and this is apricot jam petite shortbread cookies. Ooh, it says it has a perfect amount of salt and rich apricot filling mini butter cookies with rich jam. Yum. Okay, so that was everything in the September tea treat box. Now this one was definitely snack heavy and I'm not mad about that, but so usually you do get more like other not snack related products. So the only thing that wasn't like snack related was the plates and this, this month, the little holder. But I like wanna eat all of this right now, but I don't wanna eat sugar right now. But I'm so excited to make the scones, you get little cookie, lots of different types of cookies, which makes sense in a tea box. I'm surprised we didn't get any tea or anything like that, but I still thought that this was like a really good box. I am so excited. I'm gonna have like a little tea party this weekend. That'll be so fun. Um, as y'all know, I film these on Thursdays, so by the time this goes up, I may have already had my tea party, but I'm very excited. Um, tea party for one, me by myself. Let me make that clear. <laughs> I'm really a super fun person, um, but I guess the tropical, I don't, I don't know what it will be or how it will be when it comes here, but tropical storm Ian, Will be here this weekend so I don't even I don't even know y'all by the time you're seeing this all of that would have already happened but um I, I like this box <laughs> and again I do have that 10% off coupon code all right up next let's jump into the better beauty box for September now this is a brand new box to my channel I'm super excited to unbox it today now if you're unfamiliar with better beauty box which probably a lot of you are since this is the first time I'm unboxing it. This is a cruelty-free beauty subscription. It's a monthly beauty subscription. So everything inside is cruelty-free, 100% vegan, and they're conscious brands, and they do make a donation every month with some of the proceeds from the box. So this box is $39.99 a month. You can get a little bit cheaper if you sign up for longer subscription periods. And it does come with four to five beauty products inside. Now, I'm not sure whether or not I have a coupon code for this at the time of filming. If I do have one, I will put it down in the description box below. I put all my coupon codes for the boxes down there, as well as the makeup and wearing and all that fun stuff. So um, check that out if you're interested in signing up just to see if there is one. As of now, I don't have one, but I, I might, I don't know, we'll find out. When you open it up, that is what it looks like. So in the box itself, it says, each product in your Better Beauty box is verified cruelty-free, 100% vegan, not owned by a parent company that tests on animals and made from conscious ingredients for you and the planet. So then you get the card. On the back, it goes over everything inside and the total September value is $152. And for September, they donated to Beagle Freedom Project, an organization helping animals used in experiments. I love that, that's great. All right, and it looks like there are five different products inside of the box. The very first product that I'm pulling out is this one here. It's from Solara, and this is their Barrier Defense Hyaluronic Mist, which retails for $18. Y'all, I just bumped my elbow on the tailor ta table, and that was really hard to like say that. <laughs> The, that hurt. I, I'm gonna have like a elbow bruise now. That's gonna be real fun. The packaging is really, really cool on this. Oh, and it's a cute, it's a cute little mist. I love the like light blue color, but I also love like these hit, hints of like this yellow color. Kind of playing with that cool and warm tone is really fun. Um, so this is formulated to help protect against the blue light and pollution. This power packed essence replaces drying alcohol with hydrating aloe leaf juice and plumping hyaluronic acid. I don't remember if I said that it retails for $18 or not. So it just, oh, that's such cute packaging. Um, so it helps with the blue light. So this is good, like if I'm working throughout the day or editing, I can just ch ch spritz um, as I'm on, I am on the computer a lot for work for this, for everything. So, and I like that it's kind of mini. A lot of mists that you get are like really big. And I like that this one's kind of little cause it's easier for on the go and it's not so overwhelming and cluttering the space. 
really, really pretty. Then we have a serum from East 29th, and this is their Vital Serum, which retails for $67, which is quite pricey. So this is their Vital Serum. This is what it looks like in this pretty amber dro dropper bottle, dropper, <laughs> dropper bottle, dropper, <laughs> what is happening to me? Drop, when, you know, you know what I'm, you know what I'm going for. Uh, so this is delivers a high concentration of all natural ingredients after cleansing to improve hydration, texture, and tone, while also firming, promoting elasticity and smoothing wrinkles. So this does a lot of different things. It has hyaluronic acid, niacinamide, lemon rind extract, and vitamins C and E. So a nice little serum. Ooh, this is kind of cool. So this is from Elate Cosmetics, and this is their lipstick, which retails for twenty five dollars. It's like a lip pencil one though it's in the shade serene which is this pretty like mauvey pink and it like is actual like wood grain i don't know if that's yeah it's like actual wood grain i really love that so this is what it looks like i am gonna swatch because i do like this oh ooh, that's really creamy it smells like a pencil like the actual thing on my skin smells like pencil which is the only thing but that's what it looks like i was not expecting it to be that creamy because it's actually in that wood form but obviously that means that you can like there's a ton of product because you can like sh um not shred it down what is it called sharpen it down i really like that color it could obviously just be used as a lip liner as well but it does it is a little bit chubby so you can use it as a full lip i love this i love the packaging this is very like different as far as packaging and I really really like it for a lipstick and it's a really pretty approachable color for I think a lot of people. So it says this is not your typical lip pencil, it's moisturizing and long wearing for even the driest lips. You can use it as a lip liner or color inside the line. So yeah, definitely agree with what they said based on the swatch. All right, up next we have a product from Fleur and B and this is their Youth Fairy Retinol Moisturizer which retails for $35. And this is what it looks like. I've always wanted to get a product from Fleur and B, and this is my first one, so I'm really exciting. I'm really excited. Wow, I really cannot talk today, y'all. Um, so this is ideal for beginner retinol users. Their gentle anti-aging face cream blends science and nature to help reduce the appearance of fine lines, wrinkles, and dark spots. My mom actually has asked me, she's like, do you have any retinol products? Um, so I'll probably give this one to her. Ooh, it doesn't have any scent. It's a nice yellow cream. This actually looks like a good consistency for me particularly or it doesn't look like too thick it looks like it'd be really really moisturizing i think it's really really nice but again my mom asked for a retinol and this is anti-aging so i think i'm going to give this one to her but i kind of want to keep it for myself but she asked for retinol so i'll probably give her this one but again it's a really really nice moisturizer it has 18 nourishing actives inside of it and it lists them all clearly on the back and it will help rejuvenate brighten and hydrate your skin even skin tone and minimize the look of dark spots very very cool excited about that and then last but not least we have a product from estate cosmetics this is their baked highlighter and flushed which retails for ten dollars so this is what it looks like just a pretty baked highlighter I have a lot of highlighters in use right now, so I'm probably gonna put this one in a future giveaway, but it says your secret weapon for the perfect glow. Use it on your cheekbones, your eyes, and your inner corner or wherever you want more glow. All right, so that is everything in the September Better Beauty Box. I thought it was really, really good. It's a really good mix of skincare and makeup. So you get two makeup products and three skincare products, which is a pretty good mix. Again, if you're somebody who's looking for that cruelty-free and vegan type beauty box, I know a lot of you guys really um, geared towards that, then this would be a great one. And I think it's a really, really nice box. Um, again, I'm not sure whether or not I have a coupon code for this one, but if I do, I will put it down in the description box below. All right, up next, let's jump into the Copper and Pine Scent of the Month Club for October. Now, if you're unfamiliar with Copper and Pine, this is the second time I'm unboxing them on my channel, and I was obsessed with the September box and the scents inside. Now, what this is, this is a monthly candle and wax melt subscription. Um, this was sent to me free for review, and I believe that what I have will be the ultimate sniffer, which is $44.99 a month, but I'll confirm once we're inside. Now, if you're somebody who likes one or the other, you can just get the candle sniffer box, which is $36.99, or just get the mini melt sniffer, which is also $36.99. So if you prefer one or the other, you can do that, um, plus shipping on all of those boxes. Now, October 9th is International Subscription Box Day, and so she's doing a deal where if you sign up with your first box, you can get 
three free tin fresheners. So you have to sign up for the box by October 9th to get those three free tin fresheners. There'll be one of them inside of this box that I can share with you guys. I got one last one that smells so good. So let's dive inside. When you open it up, this is what it looks like. The sticker right there says, get your sniffer ready, which I love. So inside you get like a cute little art print that has all fun little like boo costumes, October 31st, the day of the dead, like little Halloween printout. Then it talks so much more about Copper and Pine and their products. So this is our mission at Copper and Pine is to provide you with products that you can use without the worry of exposing your you or your loved ones to toxic chemicals. Their hand poured candles and melts. You can feel comfortable using our products anywhere. They use 100% natural soy wax and a cotton wick and the scents are infused with essential oils to create a clean product that not only smells amazing, but is safe for you and the environment. Their products are non-toxic, zinc-free, lead-free, sulfate-free, and phthalate-free. I loved the candle in September. I still have a little bit of it left. Oh, it was like a pear fall scent. It was so good. And it was, it's like, it does not give you a headache. And these are really, really good scents. So I'm excited to jump inside. Oh, this is really cute. There's also a little template to carve a pumpkin. I love that. I will be carving a pumpkin this year. I don't know if I'll do this template because I tend to go a little bit more advanced, but maybe I'll have to carve more than one. And I always roast the pumpkin seeds. Oh, I can't wait. Okay, first up we have the little bonus product. Now we got one of these last month in like a fall print and now we're getting one in this cute, cozy, I don't know why I said cozy, cute little skeleton. These are really nice quality. Uh, towels and they're from the brand geometry these the one that i got before washed really well i like this because it's a decorative towel but it's useful like it will actually absorb and do things and be a working towel i'm not a fan of like i don't like tea towels that don't do anything that you just hang up for like looking at because that's just not the way that i function <laughs> it needs to be usable and these are and i love it oh my gosh i can make my little kitchen that's so little spooky for Halloween so I love this okay so this is what the candle looks like same as last month I really like the clean black matte type packaging it doesn't leave fingerprints on it you get this like bamboo lid now I have already smelled this scent because I got the tin freshener in it last month and it smelled so good so it's apple bourbon oh like these scents are so good like some of my favorites that I've ever gotten in boxes ever. Now maybe it's because they're fall scents and I love fall scents, but oh my gosh, this apple bourbon scent is to die for. Like to die for. I was I'm, I was so excited when she reached out and was like, yeah, I'm gonna send you the October box because when I smelled that tin freshener last month, I'm like, I have to have the candle and the wax melts because it smells so good. It's just, it's got the really sweet apple scent to it. A sweet, like not like fake apple, but a sweet real apple scent. I'm not, I don't know what bourbon's like, but it's, I can get the bourbon. It's kind of vanilla-y and it's got that like muskiness of the bourbon, but it's like, oh, it's a sweet scent overall. And it just smells so fall and so good. And I love that it's like a clean candle because a lot of my candles do give me headaches if I leave them on for too long. And I just don't have to worry about it with these. Oh, it smells so like, so good. I cannot wait to burn this. All right, and then you get the wax melt. So it comes with a cute little shovel. It's also an apple bourbon, so it's gonna smell the same. This one almost smells a little bit bourbon-y and a little less apple-y, but this is what they look like. So cute little color, little wax melts that you can put in whatever you use to do your little wax melts. And then again, you get the cute little wax melt, little scoopy scoop. All right, now I have a tin freshener. So again, you would get three of these if you sign up before October 9th. Now, this one is the sneak peek to next month's scent. So I'm gonna do that real quick, um, cause it's a secret, it's a surprise. Now I'm gonna give it a smell. So this is what they look like. Ooh, wait, that's like in a different direction, but it's still really fall. And it's almost fall transition to winter. Ooh, ooh, that is good. The color of it matches like the scent too, which is really, really cool. So these tin fresheners, I think you can like put them in a car, in a space. They like, if you open them, they like smell. So like you can just put them in a little small space and by opening them, I think just the scent goes out. I'm not 100% sure, but I really, really like this. It smells really, really good. So looking forward to November's scent. And again, you would get three free tin freshers. I'm not sure which scents that they'll be in, but you'll get three of these if you sign up before October 9th. But I'm gonna be honest, I am like over the moon. I love last month's scent. This is my favorite. This is like my favorite scent like ever. <laughs> like it's so good. 
And I'm gonna be honest, and I'm not just saying this, but ever since I got that last candle and I burned it and I love the smell and it doesn't give me a headache, I'm like, I don't really wanna burn any of my other candles. Like I only want these because they're just, like they genuinely are so good and I can't, get, I cannot get over this scent. Like November is good too, but like, I can't get over this one. This is really, really good. So definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. What do you think of this box? It's obviously kind of hard without Smell-O-Vision to know um, whether or not you'll like the box, but I'll be honest, if you like a good fall scent, the fall scents she's got down, so I definitely check them out. Now remember, if you sign up through October 9th, you can get those three free tin fresheners with your first box. All right, up next, let's jump into the Silver Swag box for October. Now, if you're unfamiliar with this box, it's a subscription for adults and seniors, but really it's a subscription for anyone. But this came, I think, probably out of the pandemic, where if you want to send something to your loved ones to stay connected, if you're busy, you just want to be connected to the people you love, this box is a great way to do that. Or if you just want to do some self-care for yourself, this is a great box as well. So it's a lifestyle box and inside you get things like household items, home gadgets, activities, personal care items, conversation cards, and more. So if you want to send a box to somebody, it doesn't even have to be somebody who's elder, because let me tell you, I am 27 years young and I'm obsessed with this box. Um, last month's box was so, it was my favorite one. It was like a movie themed box and I'm not a big movie person, but I just love that box. It was so cozy and amazing. So I'm very excited to see the October box. Now this box is $49.99 a month. Again, this was sent to me like all of the boxes in today's video. And I do have a coupon code down below where you can get $15 off of your first box. All right, when you open it up, it says, hello, October. Ooh, a little sneak peek. It looks dark, which I'm here for. Um, so on top, you get two cards. One of them has your conversation cards or conversation starters. Um, so it's like, what's your favorite time of the day? Describe your perfect night. What would be the perfect costume for you? There's more questions there, but you get a list of questions. And so if you're far away from loved ones, these are great conversation starters and way to be connected. For me personally, I think these are great because when I'm leading calls or leading meetings at work and I need a little like icebreaker, I'm not gonna lie, I keep these cards by my desk and I'm like, okay. And I use these as little icebreakers. So if you're somebody who needs icebreakers, these are a great way to do that. Um, the theme, by the way, is Midnight Masquerade, which is very fun. Then on the other card, it does list everything inside of the box. The very first thing that we're pulling out is this here, which I believe is a candle. So this is from Dixie Grace, and this is their Harvest Moon Wood Wick Candle. Ooh, okay, so it's a wooden wick one. Yes, it is. Ooh, and it's a fun gray color. Okay, I'm gonna try not to smell it yet, but it says, this has scents of leaves, pine, cinnamon, apple, and cloves that bring fall right into your home. Ooh, oh, sexy man fall. Sexy man fall, y'all. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's sexy man fall. That's like that leather, yummy, you know. Um, so it's handcrafted in the Midwest. Um, it's a soy candle, eight ounces does give you basic safety and burning instructions. I really like their packaging. I love the kind of, yeah, anyway, Dixie, handwritten by Dixie Grace. They have a really pretty logo. I mean, now the fun thing about the wood wicks is that they do kind of like flicker and flutter, which is like fun if you turn the lights off and you have your little flickery candle. Mmm, this is, a, that's sexy yummy. That is, when I saw like apple, cinnamon, clove, I thought that that's what I would get primarily, but you get the leaves and pine more than you get those. Those are more like back notes. Really, really yummy. If you have, I don't, this is a strong, not not a strong scent, but this is a darker scent. So if you're somebody who's sensitive to scents, I'm not sure if you'll love this, but I think it's really, really good. And I can't wait to burn it. This box creates like an atmosphere, like an event. And so it's like, I just, oh, it's so fun. Ooh, the next thing out is from Little Moon Essentials. And this is their relaxed mineral bath salts. So this is a soothing soak before bed, unwind with this floral fantasy of petals and essential oils. Ooh. Mm. It smells so good. Uh, I can't wait to use it. Y'all know I love bath products. I'm not able to take bath right, baths right now. I did have a surgery last week and I'm, I'm fine. It was nothing serious. Um, it was just something you gotta do sometimes. And so I can't take baths for a little while, which I'm bummed about, but this smells really good and natural. And once I'm able to take baths again, can't wait. Um, Yes, please. I don't know if this, I don't, I don't know why this makes sense for this, but this is from Moonlight Mixes and this is their Wicked Minis Crackers, fresh dill and satisfying crunch. Nothing wicked about this snack. I guess cause it's like the brand is wicked is why they threw it in. I mean, I love dill. <gasps> Wait, I love these. Are these like 
What are these crackers called? I, don't, I just unlocked a part of my memory of eating these type of, not with dill on them, but just like the salted ones. What are those crackers called that are shaped like this? Cause you have them in like soup and stuff because now I need to go buy them from the grocery store because I have not had them since I was a kid and I need them. <gasps> I mean, I'm gonna eat these ones, but I also want like the plain ones. <gasps> those look so good. You know what? I said I was gonna try a snack. This is a snack I'm trying because I need to. Ooh, smells really dilly and good. Oh my gosh, those are so, those are really good. Those are actually dangerously good, I'm not gonna lie. They're really good. They're very salty, but I don't mind that. These would be great on a soup, on a salad as like a crouton, or you could just eat them straight out of the bag, which to be honest is what I'm gonna do because I'm too lazy for all of that. So I'm really excited about these. Those are really, really good. Oh, there's also a tips to burning your Dixie Grace candle card here on the candle. Ooh, okay. Up next we have this book. This is a very nice quality book. This is the Gibbs Smith Publishing Tales from the Midnight Masquerade. This magical adult coloring book invites you inside a midnight masquerade at a grand mansion, colored pencils included. So you do get a set of color. These are the three leaf colored pencils. I've gotten these in other boxes before. Um, or if you have fancier ones, you can, but those work just fine too. This is like a hard to cover book. Okay, I wanna open this up and like see what's going on inside. I mean, it even has like foiling on the outside. Normally, oh, this book belongs to a look at the bunny rabbits. Oh, I cannot. This, the pages are like an actual book. Oh, they're like, they're thicker. The paperweight is way thicker than a book. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so fun. I want to draw on it with markers. This looks like a fun marker coloring book. Oh my God, look at the little kitty cat knight. And the mousy mouse. Oh my gosh, this I can't. Oh, I'm gonna have so much fun. Okay, this is this is really, really nice. I like this and I like that it's like good quality because you can like put it in your bookshelf and it'll look just so nice. Even as a coffee table book, it would look pretty. All right, then up next, you do get a Capzone Satin Eye Mask. When it's time to say goodnight, care for your skin and block out the world with this soft and comfy sleeping mask. So I'm getting this like cozy, burn your candle, eat your snacks, take your little bath, do your little coloring book, and then put your little mask on before bed, which is so cute. And of course, we have some more snacks. The next one out is from Hammond's. Uh, candy and this is their midnight snack bar. It says hungry for a midnight snack pretzels cookies brittle marshmallow and cereal This bar can satisfy every craving <gasps> That is so good. I'm curious. Is this like is this a dark chocolate bar? I Feel like midnight snack you would think it'd be dark chocolate, but I hope it's I don't know it doesn't say It says milk chocolate and then dark chocolate cookies in it. Ooh, this sounds really really like my mouth is watering these were so good and this sounds delicious too this box has good snacks and then last but not least we have one more snack this is from big spoon roasters this is their figgy chai peanut butter bar this is their on the go nutrition with fresh roasted peanuts and almond butter dried figs wildflower honey and chai tea spices oh that sounds good it sounds a little healthy but it sounds really good um wow this was a fun box. Again, it's kind of like an experience. These are things that you can do with somebody. You can do them by yourself. It's like a self-care moment. And it's always just like an experience, which I love. Like I said, the snacks are always really good. These are like, I'm gonna devour those. Those are like actually dangerous. This sounds dangerous. This, I don't know if it sounds as dangerous, but it still sounds good. You got that sexy man fall candle, little bath salts, your coloring book coloring pencils and your little mask. So definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. This is becoming one of my favorite boxes to unbox. I really, really like it. And again, I do have that $15 off coupon code down below in case you're interested in signing up. All right, up next, let's jump into the Entry Envy Halloween box. Now, if you're unfamiliar with Entry Envy, I actually just unboxed the first box last week and what it is is you get a sign so you do have to buy the sign up front i got the indoor sign they also have the outdoor signs and this is mine now this is the september kind of fillable and what i have 
to show you today is the October Halloween fillable. But you purchase the sign, there's an outdoor one as well. You can have it different ways. So mine is the one that you hang, but there are different versions that you can get. And then for $30 each month, you can get a new fillable decor. So if you're somebody who just doesn't have a lot of time to think about decor, I think this is a great box because every month you get stuff shipped to you to fill in. You can also do it quarterly. If you do the fillables quarterly, it's $34.99 every quarter. But the monthly box, you'll get all the seasonal stuff too. Now I'm excited because I love Halloween and this is a Halloween box. So when you open it up, this is what it says inside. So it says happy Halloween and then it provides instructions on how to set up your sign. So let me take out the September stuff so we can decorate for Halloween. All right, so I have removed the old materials from the sign, which is instruction number one. Oh, and this obviously doesn't go in the thing, but they have a little bag. Eat me a little candy corns inside. Oh yeah, I love candy corn, so yum. All right, so the next step is to locate the moss and then you cover the foam and you use floral pins to secure. So you do get two little floral pins to kind of stick it in with. All right, so for the Halloween box, the moss is a really fun green color. Last month it was more of like, there. the September one was more like a brown neutral color. All right, then we have, they're wrapped in this really fun like green. We have the things that you stick in. So we have this really cute um, floral pick with the little cute little striped pumpkins. And this like looks like little branches or cobwebs. It's like a sparkly black. So you choose a place to stick that in. And then there's also a sparkly little kitty cat to stick in as well. Okay, so last month I went on the other side, this side. So this month I went on this side just for fun. And then there's a little bag. It says add magic on it. And inside are some little twinkle lights. So it says add your lights for a little magic. Don't forget to remove the clear battery protection strip. Oh, they are so fun. Now I forgot to mention that each month you can like pick usually certain themes so you can choose modern or whatever. So there are different styles. So if this isn't your style, there are some other styles that you can get. Oh my gosh, it's so fun. All right, let me decorate with lights. Okay, I'm probably gonna have to rearrange the lights, but that's what I did. Oh, it's so fun and it's so, so cute. So this is the little Halloween box. I love the little kitty and the pumpkins and the lights are so fun. The nice thing is once you start to get this, you can start to build up your collection so you could take the lights from this month and use them in another month in the way that you decorate. So that was their happy Halloween, I guess, October box, which was so fun. And I do have a coupon code down below where you can get 15% off of your first box in case you're interested in signing up for Entry Envy. All right, now let's jump into the journal junk sack and the journal junk box for October. Now, if you're unfamiliar with these boxes, these are monthly stationary subscriptions and they have like cute office things. Like I said, I showed you that cup earlier, which I've now finished. So I put it in the kitchen in between boxes um, so I can wash it. Um, now there are two different boxes. So the journal junk sack is their mini subscription. This one is $23.95 a month. They then have their full subscription, which is $44.95 a month. Um, but they come with completely different things. So you can totally get both of them. Again, these are sent to me free for review. And I do have a coupon code down below where you can get 15% off your first box. All right, we're gonna kick things off with the mini journal junk sack and it comes bubble wrapped all nice. So I think that this might be breast cancer awareness theme because it's pink and I see a little ribbon in here. So the first thing is a little card and it says live life one day at a time. So I do think that this, it, this I don't know about the big one, but this one does seem like it might be that related. Then there's always like a little, I don't know if this is a coaster or like a little quote card. It says, never apologize for showing feeling. When you do so, you apologize for truth. Benjamin Disraeli. Very cool. Then up next, we have a little pen. So it has a cute little pink and neon green tassel and it's got gold and then it's white with, um, I was gonna say yellow polka dots. Those are pink polka dots. Very cool. Ooh, stickers. I love stickers. Um, this is from Paper House and this is a life organized paper sticker set with 104 pieces inside. There's another set of stickers. It's like a, I think it's a sticker thing I got from this box that I've been using. Um, like I said, I had that surgery last weekend, so I've had to like keep track of certain things. And so to make it fun, I've been using stickers to like check off the things I need to do every day, uh, like the, you know, to help recover and do all the stuff you need to do. So really fun, some more cute stickers. And some of these have like pink foiling on them which is really fun. And then we have a little notebook from Graphique and this is their Let's Make Today Beautiful journal. So it's a nice pink. Um, this is like the, yeah, a really pink color. 
It's just got lines and it has the date on it. So just a nice little, it's a nice soft touch to it. Very, very cool. Um, I was hoping it was going to be more like October, -y, like Halloween-y, but I do totally love the like breast cancer awareness and I'm dropping the pen on the floor, but I do love that they have like this breast cancer awareness type moment. At least I'm assuming so based on the carding from the pink. So that is the mini. And now let's jump into the regular journal junk box. Again, this one is the $44 and 95 a cent, not and a 95 cent. Oh my gosh. And 95 cents a month, 44 95 a month box. All right. When you open it up, that is what it looks like. Okay. So I was right. This is their awareness is power breast cancer awareness box on the back of this one it does list everything inside with a retail value and then it gives october journal prompts so for each week so there are four different ones um there's a prompt so one of them is what is one habit you'd like to start so you can kind of use those as journal prompts if you're somebody who journals Ooh, the very first thing out is a planner and this is a 2023 planner i've already purchased my 2023 planner because i have a very specific one that i use but i'm definitely curious to peek into this one so this is the manifesto 18th month 18 month vegan leather planner by graphique which retails for 17.99 so it says take a breath go outside laugh loudly drink some water tell someone you love them oh, i like that Ooh, okay, so it says keep life simple. And it's got stickers on the inside with the a pretty gold foiling, two pages of stickers. So payday, rent, brunch, lunch, dinner, playing hooky, hair appointment, mini putty, spa day, dinner date. This planner belongs to. Ooh, okay. So by week, this is what it looks like. So it gives you a little place to write stuff down. Things to do, top three, next in line, random thoughts, to buy, to email. Ooh, okay, I really like this. It does give you the monthly view and it has little tabs for each of the months. This is really, really nice. I actually do like this one. This is different from the journal that I use, but it's really, really cool. And I'm actually pretty excited about this. Um, I Like I said, I already have my planner, so I don't know if I'm gonna keep this one or give this to someone, but it goes from July, 2022 to December 23, so you could already go ahead and use it. It's really, really pretty little journal. Ooh, up next is actually really cute. This is a two zipper pencil case and organizer by Yobi, which retails for 10.99. It's really, really cute. It's got a little pocket on this side, and then on the back, it does have a zip pocket with like a little rubber thing there and then it opens up with another little rubber pull. Ooh, this would be really good for travel. Like if you're traveling and you're taking stuff with you, I really like this. And obviously like you don't actually have to use this as a pencil case. You know, you could put other little things in here um, as you travel or things like that, chargers, whatever. Ooh, I like this a lot. I may not use it for stationery, but I'm definitely gonna use it to organize. Um, this pencil organizer donates one item to a child in need. You buy, Yobi gives. Very, very cool. Ooh, okay. Always love getting scissors. As an unboxer, you just need scissors or something sharp all the time. These are scissors with a grid blade from UB bought for $9.99. Ooh, these are nice. I'm not going to take them out of the package because I'm going to take a picture of the box, but I'm definitely going to use these. They have a good feeling to them. They got a nice grip on the inside. They have a fun design. They're actually pretty aesthetic. I've got, I got these at Target. I like having aesthetic scissors for whatever reason. So very excited to have another pair of scissors. I feel like you can never have enough scissors. And so far the color palette is just such a fun kind of pink theme. Now we kind of get into more like specific breast cancer awareness. So we have some stickers. These are 3D breast cancer awareness stickers by Paper House. These retail for $4.99. So they are little pop-up stickers. So, so pretty. Ooh, then we got a nice thank you card. I love getting cards in the mail, like, like this so I can send them. It's a pretty thank you card. It's got nice little glitter on it. It also has a little sticker that's like a happy mail sticker that you can like seal the envelope shut with. Oh, I love that. Gold foiling on the thank you and then that bright pink envelope to go with it. So this is the pink flowers and glitter thank you card by Graphique, which retails for $4.99. I'm somebody who like, I love stationery and I love pretty cards, but I have the hardest time spending $5 on a card when you can pick them up at the dollar store. So I always love getting the really nice cards in subscription boxes. Up next, we have a pen. This is the Pink Monaco Pen by Bruno Visconti, which retails for $5.99. I feel like I have one of these in like a green or a blue color that we've got in a previous box. It has the thing on it, so I won't take that off, but it's a really nice soft touch 
pen in this really pretty pink color with the gold accents. I really like that. And you can stick it in your little Yobi case or Yubi. Yubi. Why do I say Yobi? It's Yubi. Then we have a pair of socks. Ooh, these are really soft like super soft compared to most socks that you get in boxes and socks in general. These are the Hope Love Fight Breast Cancer Awareness Socks by Me Moy, which retail for $6. They're really, really soft. I like those. And it fits sizes nine to 11. Then we have a little lapel pin. This is the What You Got lapel pin by Paper House slash Goldmine and Coco, which retails for $8. These are great for clothing, bags, gift projects, and more. It's like sparkly pink. The world needs what you got. Oh, that's really cute. So it's a collab between Paper House and then Goldmine and Coco. I have a little pin jacket, so I might add it to that, but you could put it on like a tote bag, lots of fun things. Oh, that's really, really cute. I love things with like positive uplifting um, messages. I tend to be a pessimist, like in my natural state. So I like having positivity around me to pull me out of that. And then last but not least, we have some really cute gummies. These are the pink Cadillacs berry flavored gummies. These are gluten-free and non-GMO. These are by Uli by Garrett's and these retail for $6.50. So really, really fun little snack as you're journaling. And that is everything in the October journal junk box. I thought it was really, really fun. I think it's great that it's breast cancer awareness theme. I, the thing, I like love fall boxes. And so I'm like, I'm really hoping that their November box is really fall theme. Cause I was like hoping that this is going to be like pumpkins and black cats and skeletons and all that kind of stuff. Um, but I still think that this theme was great and is probably more usable for things throughout the year with that overtone of the pink. And I love, I do love that they support breast cancer awareness through this box. So definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below on the journal junk box and the journal junk sack. And again, I do have that 15% off coupon code in case you're interested in signing up. All right. So those were all of the boxes and all the products in this week's subscription box Sunday. All right. Favorite product, favorite box. Let me look around. I put all the boxes on the floor after after this. Um, I'm going to have to say my favorite box is either silver swag box or the copper and pine box. I'm torn between the two. Um, and my favorite product might be those garden doll crackers <laughs> or the copper and pine, that candle, the apple bourbon candle is insane. Like those are my, those are my favorite products, but there's a lot of good, like the scissors, the pouch, like there's, so, there's so much good stuff. There's so much good stuff in here. It's, it's really hard to pick. So down in the comments below, what was your favorite box? What was your favorite item in this video? Let me know your thoughts on everything down below. If you like this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up and make sure that you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on a future upload. And I'll see you in my next video.